Okay guys, welcome back to a new video. I'm with a uh, 15 dot Josh. Yo dude. He's with on the Chingus with no pegs because he took him off because he's a batty fish. You're a batty fish. Obviously. How many likes for that for a review on a channel? Zero, because you're a batty fish. No no no, how many likes? Zero. Well, no no no, actually we'll push it, we'll push it. How many likes for a channel review? Seventy. 70. You can get 70. You get so many views now. You can get 70. Alright guys, you, you know what the, the target is. 70 likes for a Chenga review. And it's not even done yet. It's going to be better than this. It's going to be better. It's a bit dirty right now. He's going to yeah, clean it up for the Chenga review. Very, very and, he's, and he still needs one more part. And then well, the... I need one more part until like, you can do a check on it. But I, need, I do need a few more. So yeah, guys, 70 likes. I know that's a big target. We usually get about 30, 40 likes. So I know you guys can get an extra 30 likes because I know this video is probably going to get like 300 views or something along those lines. So let's try and hit 70 likes on this video and then we'll get a Chenga review. But today, we're not talking about the Chenga, we're talking about the Monster Quad. Now guys, today it's a Monster Quad review. You've already seen the thumbnail and you've seen the title. So right now, we're in Watford Junction. No. And uh, we're just waiting we're for a train. Waiting for a train to King's we're Landing. We are in We're New in New Jersey. Jersey. We're waiting for a train, train to King's Langley from New Jersey. It's about a 25 hour train. It's going to tell me how homeless do I look? If I stand here like this. Yeah, I mean, we have been sitting in this train station for about half an hour because the train got cancelled. So we're going to go. We should have just rode it, to be honest. But we're going to be getting the train to King's because I'm going home. But I have got a couple of clips that I'll put in at the end of this video. So from when I went to Hemel last. But. So, we're going to be doing a review on the Monster Quad. Now, the first thing that I'll say about this bike is it's a massive bike um, compared to any other SC bike I've rode. It's bigger than the Beast Mode and it's bigger than the Fast Ripper. I know the Fast Ripper is 29, but the frame on this feels bigger because as you can see, it goes up there. If I was tell them to do one thing, I know it's kind of hard because the wheel goes up here. I would have said, I mean, I understand why they had it up Safety. here because it is a 29 inch. Dirty, right? I just thought your video needed to know. But I would have made this bit shorter because it would be cool. But if I put crypto, personally, tape here, I think that this is about this is about six inches. Yeah. They should have Wait, that it. is not six inches. That's like four inches. No, this yeah. is what Josh thinks six inches is. No, mine's bigger than this. Mine's this is tiny, sharp. Don't even try to act like mine isn't bigger than this. But um, well, what, what is it? Your frame. Oh yeah, my frame, my frame. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. All right, PG. We're not trying to get. It's the to difference monetize. between this area right here. We're not trying to get demonetized in this video because no, this video could do I, well. I feel like they should make this instead of four inches, they should make it about two point six because two point six is a good is a good sort of angled um, angled seat height as well. Because you've got to think the taller it is, the more it goes back, and the further back your seat is, the closer you are to the pegs. Big facts from Josh. So obviously it's quite a big. I'm not bike. Josh. I'm Mike. So big facts from Mike. <laughs> Mike. Big facts from Mike. So the frame's quite big which makes it sometimes harder to do certain combos but it does feel nice for riding around like a cruiser bike so that is one thing i will say it is more more comfortable than the beast mode and the fat especially the fat fats aren't very comfortable for just riding around <laughs> i'm exposing the bike we got a bit of throttle grip on these grips i'm not sure what grips these are but these grips what are do you mean rare. you don't know what grips these are it says se racing yeah i know they're se racing but i don't know what bike they're from uh, if you know what bike this is from, let me know down in the comments. So another thing that I like about the bike, my Fat Ripper also had this, my 16. It's a bit dirty, but it's got blue chrome hubs. Obviously the wheels are 29 inch, so this is the biggest SE bike they've made. A 29 inch with a big chrome. Now the most important and a thing, bar end. the most important thing about the bike that you've noticed is the framing. Obviously it's got this like weird crisscross kind of. And this allows you to frame new tricks. Like you could stand in there. You could stand here, yeah, and you could also stand underneath your bike and right, do a leg of a I did think of doing a trick where you put your foot in there, because that'd be a new trick. You do a trick where you put your, your toe in here, because you have good bar ends. So yeah, um, it doesn't come with this seat. It comes with a monster quad seat, but this seat has been put on. It's a bit ripped. I'll take it's a block fly seat. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yo, bro. Uh, and it doesn't come with a stock seat clamp. There's hardly any stock parts in there. 
Ooh. Oh, oh if you make like an explosion when I drop, I know you won't do it because you can never be on. But guys, imagine there was an explosion when I dropped. I might actually, I don't know if I can be on. Oh, it didn't come out. <laughs> yeah, the seat post is in proper tight. <laughs> so it's got these pegs on it, which are upgraded. They're like, they've got grip tape on them, which obviously you need if you want to be doing combos. Another thing I'll say that's quite good about the Monster Quad for the price, I think they're like, what this? 800? I don't have a clue. I think they're 800. Oh wait, actually no, no, I do know. They are about um, 200. <laughs> they're about 200 pounds, yeah? If you buy it off Max, because Max is selling it. I'm not selling it for 200. So, um, it's got Holotech bottom bracket, which is quite good, and it means they're easier to... Can you stop messing around I'm with my bike? Your grip I'm trying back. to review it. Yeah, review it. And it's got an SE racing stem. It doesn't come with this one. It comes with a blue one, but I think this is from a 2016 fat, rather than a um, than the Monster Quad. The Monster Quad comes with a chrome blue one. I kind of wish it still had that on it. Um, there you go. It comes with a really big chrome blue chainring, which is quite nice, and obviously a blue bottom bracket, which obviously just makes it stand out a bit more. Now, it does have a massive cassette on the back wheel, which helps you go quicker. Now, on my bike, I've got this brake, which is really dead. I don't really like it, and it's just a bit dead, to be honest. I'm checking what brake actually is. It's just a Shimano, isn't it? Oh yeah, it's just a Shimano. Yeah, it's just a Shimano. I think it might be the ones you get on C100s. Yeah, it is. It's upside down. Yeah, but it's upside down, so it's meant to be for the right side. It's upside down for more swag. And another thing is, it obviously comes with the V-tires. I think it would have been cool if they had done it how they did it on the Beast Mode, where they have Beast Mode on it, and they should have put Monster Quad. But it doesn't come with that. It just comes with V-tires. They've been painted in white, which I did on my fat, if you remember that. You know what else comes with the bike? The tires bike? are a bit worn down, sadly. But that's not really a big deal, to be Should honest. I tell you something else that comes with the bike? Because the back one isn't as worn down. What comes with the bike? It comes with forks. Now, it doesn't come with any forks. It comes with ones you use in your kitchen. <laughs> it does. Are you a joker? No, I'm not joking. I'm being serious. So guys, you know when you use a you know you know when you use a fork to like oh, to like shit. um get your breakfast out of your bowl. <laughs> Oi, I'm actually an idiot. You're actually better funny though. No, I I'm bored, okay. I'm just trying to make some fun with my life. Not my bean! <laughs> not my bean. So guys, if I was gonna compare this to any bike, I'd say it feels like, like a fat quad bus. Skinnier dude and longer. I'd say, nah, I'd say it feels like a fat quad has a 2.6 inch there as well, you know. Can I can I finish what I'm saying? No. Fucking worm. I'd say it Did feels you just me a worm? I'm like quitting now. I'm quitting. I'm going home. I'm going okay, home. Bye. This year it feels like a nice C2. Alright, Josh is gone. I mean he's not really gone because well, I do need my bag before I go to so like Oh, uh, yeah, cheap. This is got money, and I've got the wallet, dude. Ah! Yeah, do, do, do you want to trade? Trade? Yeah. All right. So, so yeah, um, it's got. It feels like a nice C2, but obviously it's got the same kind of frame as a fat quad does. Now, guys, I do want to get a fat quad, but right now I don't actually have the money for one. Oh, look who's back! Yo, it's been a whole year. I'm making a comeback. Okay, guys, it's I'm twenty. It it's twenty twenty two. Still haven't got the fat quad. <laughs> but yeah guys, if you didn't know, that is the, my dream bike and I do want to get that eventually. I should have it. You've been about it since he was like five and it, no one knew about it when he was five. But I did. But you did because... Because everyone watching this video right now subscribed. Are you? Are you actually subscribed? So yeah guys, um, I'm gonna put in a couple clips on the Monster Quad all the ones that I managed to get. So I know this video I didn't really talk about the actual bike too much. It comes, but with, some, if it you, comes with some good pedals, guys. These pedals are dead. Yeah, I know. <laughs> There's some dead pedals. But should I give it? Should I give a quick overview because you didn't explain it much? Okay, go on. All right, guys. So we have the uh, we have the blue SE grips. We have the uh, the black bars. The uh, silver almost said gold stem. We have the Shimano brake. We also have the um, SE silver forks with a sticker on one side, no stick on the other side. It comes with V tires. It has silver rims. It has black dust cap. It has a um, blue hub. Front hub. Doesn't need the bolts up round. Yeah, you have bolts as well, because bikes come with bolts. Then we have a frame, uh, we have a top cap bolt, um, then we have some spaces. We have a seat, we have a quick release seat. Oh, I don't want to break that. Um, and then we have, uh, you can't remember, 
I uh, can't forget, I mean, the four inch bit there. Then it comes with pedals, comes with cranks, silver cranks, comes with blue chain ring, comes with a chain. And believe it or not, bikes also come with chains. Um, comes with some pegs, comes with a blue hub in the back, comes with brake caliber, because believe it or not, if you have a front brake, it also has a back brake. But this bike doesn't have a front brake, but it also has a back brake. You can't put a front brake on though. No guys, see, things with this right here, here, is where you're meant to put like a front uh, brake there. Like Actually, wait, no, I will say one thing, yeah. If you buy an SE bike from America... They don't allow they, you to have front brakes. No, no, brakes. no, no, it's, yeah, they, it's, these bits here, yeah, the little adapter bit here, that's only welded on if the bike's going to the UK. So if you buy one that's like, you buy one from the US and you pay like, fuck Guys, money, when you buy an SE bike brand new, it doesn't come with any brakes, so make sure... No, it does, it, does, it does come with brakes, it comes with the deadest <laughs> brakes, so. But if you buy one that's... Um, it comes with upside down brakes. If you buy one that's American, then obviously it's going to be dead. You know, one thing I haven't said about the um, bike, it comes with a screw card. Oh. So yeah, that is the one thing. It will come, if you buy it from the UK, it will come with a front brake caliper, and it will come with a front brake on. But if you buy it... Comes with a beast mode seat. It, no, it comes with a monster quad seat, but we've got the block slides. But we have the beast mode seat on now. We have the beast mode seat on. Yeah, as you can see, it says... I don't want to make, this, I don't want to make this video ridiculously long. It's already going to be really long, because I'm not cutting any of this down. This is, is just going to be... Is it four inches like this? It's like 12 minutes already, or 11 minutes. It's like four inches like this long. So yeah, I'm going to go into the clips of me on the Monster Quad now. If you have made it this far, then don't forget to drop a like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and... Hey dude. Yeah, let's get straight into the clips. Guys, I did forget that I was going to do a cinematics on it, so I'm going to put in the cinematics before I put in the clips, so let's get straight into the cinematics. Run that up, Rico. Rico. 